And JBL here at ringside welcoming you to Minneapolis, Minnesota. Hey, I got top billing tonight. I like it. Keep it up. Well, what can I say? These Minneapolis fans have got me in such a great mood. I'm feeling especially generous tonight. Seeing a match like this makes me proud to be part of this company. I'm with you, partner. You just can't experience a thrill like this anywhere else and that's because you're not going to see athletes like the wwe superstars anywhere else Cole. you certainly aren't they're the greatest athletes in the world and this is the only place you'll see them doing what they do best Ugh. and there's the reversal come on quit showing off this is a wrestling match not a popularity contest this before he's been wrestling his style of match and he's coming up on a big payoff wow great reversal we're hearing the first amendment time for another superstar to join the match a textbook reversal can he follow up oh. you talk about raw power you talk about intensity oh. Have you ever seen a superstar like Batista? He's impressive, no question. But it's not like he's the biggest or the... Instead of pandering to the fans, you should really keep your head in the match. Come on, you're looking at a superstar who can feed off a crowd and use that energy to win the match. Even if you wind up winning a match like this, you're going to be feeling it for the next week. And here's a little something for the fans. That's why they love him. Who cares what they think? All he's doing here is giving his opponent a chance to recover. I've said it before and I'll say it again. Nothing costs you a match quicker than overconfidence. Look at the intensity. He's ready to start busting some heads. I think we might be looking at the future of the WWE. He's got this crowd solidly behind him. And now he's going to give them exactly what they want to see. You can't just keep playing to the crowd. That's a huge distraction in my opinion. These fans have got something they want to share with us. That's their right. They paid for their tickets after all. Look at this. No fear on the face of this superstar. Yeah, but that kind of thing's not going to win you the match. When you talk about a man who's done it all in this business, you don't have to look any further. He can taunt all he wants, but once he's lost the match, he's going to wish he spent this time going after his... Here comes another superstar just to keep things interesting. You know, there's such a thing as playing to the crowd too much, and that's what I'm seeing here. I disagree. He's wrestled this match his way. You can show off for the crowd if you want, but all that does is let your opponent rest up. Actually, I think it's a great display of confidence on the part of this great superstar. And the crowd has come alive. Look at him. He's just radiating confidence, and he's got a lot to be confident about. He looks a little overconfident to me. This could come back to bite him. He's going in for the kill. Batista Bomb! My God! I think he might have knocked his opponent out cold with that one! He's one. going for the pin. Oh, Here's one. the pin. This could be Two. it. Each of the... Here's the moment he's been waiting for. He's in the match. That reversal might stop his opponent's momentum dead. What a counter that! This could be big, but it could backfire. So much can go wrong. This is just dumb. You don't win a match by taunting your opponent to death. I disagree. Getting the crowd on your side can be a huge psychological boost. He was one step ahead on that one. That was a textbook oh. reversal. a little time to give his opponent a piece of his mind. You sure he can spare it? Uh. Orton's 
never back down from a fight. His mouth might get him in trouble. This is a big risk. Will it pay off? Look at that. That's going to go the big with the fans and build some momentum. Yeah, that's just great. Why don't you just quit showing off and get down to business? He is getting down to business. He's in the sports entertainment business, isn't he? Here it is. He's building up a head of steam, and he's about to let his opponent have it. And if his opponent is smart, that's not the rule book, but it's not a crime if you don't get caught. I don't believe it. How could the referee have missed that? What a cowardly move. He can't win fair and square, so he tries to screw his opponent out of the victory. Hey. Talk about adding insult to injury. And these fans love it. Yeah, but you got to worry more about the injury and less about the insult till the match is over. The adrenaline is pumping. The crowd is coming alive. This is what they came to see. Hey, try to strain yourself a little bit, okay? You're supposed to be calling this down the middle. Man, this one's turned into a fight. Pure and simple. We knew it was going to be intense. We knew it was going to be physical. But I don't think anyone was prepared for this. I got to admit, it, look at the fans. They know exactly what he's up to. Oh, my God. What a Batista bomb. Look at this. Pen There's one. the cover. Can he do Two. it? He anticipated that move perfectly. I've been looking forward to this match all night. So have I. It's certainly been one of the most anticipated matchups in recent weeks. He's going up, and what goes up must come down. Nice one. I always thought there were too many rules in this business anyway. Well, I personally was looking forward to a clean, competitive matchup. He's got him covered. Two. Three. Night after night, the WWE superstars never fail to amaze a high-risk maneuver in the works from that top turnbuckle. He slipped out of that one. Man, this crowd is really swelling this guy's head. There's no doubt that these fans love him, and he's feeding off that energy right now. The Undertaker's got an impressive history here in WWE but you're only as good as your last match. How can you say that? The dead man has proven himself time and time again. Undertaker Ooh. has earned his rep, no doubt about it, but you gotta know when to call it a day. There's a fine line between legend and has been. I can't believe you can sit here and even imply that the Undertaker might be a has been. That could be hazardous to your health. Maybe that's why I didn't come out and say it then. I'm just saying the thing about being at the top, One, he's three seconds away two, from victory. Three. I certainly don't envy the referee in this match. No kidding. No matter what call you make, you're going to get on the bad side of at least one superstar. And that's about the last place you want to be if you're not a superstar. He One, may get the three count right two, here. Three. Here are your winners, Kane Batista and Randy.